Hello YouTube, and today um, what I'm going to be showing you is I'm going to show you um, how to make your own thingy, um, mouse pointer, uh, just like I have here, and the one I normally use, which is here. And I'm going to show you how to make that. And I will put um, any links you need um, in the description. So um, visit those. Um, what you need for this is you need paint.net and you need icon art. Um, so first what you want to do is you want to open up icon art. Minimise it. Actually no. Open up icon art and see whatever colour is here next to mask you'll see mask, a little arrow, and it's pointing to a colour. Whatever colour that is, remember it, so it's black. So, minimise that. So go on to paint.net, go to file, new, width, 32, and height, 32. Make sure you've got it set to pixels, inches. Click OK, and you have a tiny box. The size, the right size for a cursor. And just zoom in here and um, fill it in black because that was the colour. Fill it in black and then add a new layer. And in that new layer, um, create whatever you want uh, like a rounded rectangle, a normal rectangle, um, a circle. I recommend a circle or draw whatever you want. I'm just going to use a circle here. you got to change the colour. I'll change it to... red. So... I'll draw a red circle. Move it. Draw a red circle and fill it in uh, purple that colour. Yeah that looks good. Okay. Okay. So now I need to draw an arrow. That's the most important part for obvious reasons. So add a, add a new layer. Use the pencil tool and I'll make this arrow a sort of goldy colour. And let me just draw it here. There we go. A little taller. A little longer. There we go. Okay, and then add another layer. Add a layer for everything, you, every different thing you do. Um, and add some text. Um, um, I'll set it to the lowest one. So I'll set it to six point. And I'll have the text white. And I'll type in uh, Jake. Jake. Um, let me just move out the way here. Nah, never mind, I'll just leave it as Jake. So, Jake in the middle. Um, actually, I'll change the colour to a sort of goldy colour again. So, um, Control C. Get rid of the text. Add new text. I'll put Jake. It's kind of blurry, but it's meant to be like that. Okay, so you now have your cursor. Um, ignore what is black, because uh, that won't be there. 
that will not be there. So when you have it um, as you want, um, if you want you can like uh, rotate rotate the text. Um, but um, once you're done, you get a file, save as, and save it as a BMP file, which is the next one down, not a PDN, a uh, BMP. And save whatever you want. Um, let's say, we save it as Jake Cursor. Click save. And that's what it's going to look like without the black. Click OK and flatten it to put it all on one layer. It won't, it won't um, change it or anything, so it's all on one layer. Then go back to Icon Art, go File, um, Import from File, and go to wherever you saved it. So, Jake Cursor, and click this tick here. So there you have it, your cursor. And um, Mask means it'll mask the black, it won't show the black. Um, so you won't have the black. So once you um, have opened up your cursor, here's a little preview of it up here, where my cursor is. Um, you want to go to this um, hotspot arrow here. It's above the pencil, and it's over to the right. Um, set hotspot. It's normally in the top left-hand corner. So I'm just going to set mine there, top left-hand corner, and click accept and you have your cursor so you go on to start computer no not computer sorry control panel bring up mouse pointers get rid of that pointers um, click on normal select here select browse go to where have you saved it so I think we saved it in document yep um, no, no, we didn't save it in doc. Oh no, you've got to save it in icon art first. So file, um, save frame as cursor, and we'll call it again Jake cursor. Save. And then you go to mouse properties and find where you saved it. Jake cursor, apply, and OK. And you've made your very own cursor. You can make um, really advanced with these. Um, you can put your face on it. It's really good. It's really good, this program. Um, so that is the um, tutorial, and I'll see you in my next video. Please subscribe.